Hi everyone, welcome to the E-Ink channel. My name is Nicole Ward and I'm on the SAE team here at E-Ink. Today, we're unboxing and walking through one of our e-paper kits that you can purchase from the E-Ink kit shop, which we've linked to below in the video description. Following the purchase of a kit, you'll receive a link via email with all the necessary software to customize your display. The kit we're unboxing today features our Kaleido 3 Outdoor EPD, as well as a Concerto Driving Board, which is sold separately. Let's dig in. So first, I'll connect the EPD to the Concerto Board via this adapter, and this FBC adapter, and I'll be connecting on CON402. Then I'll be connecting the front light via this flex cable to the front light adapter on J8. Then I'll connect the adapter to the concerto board um, via J9. So J9 on the adapter. We'll connect to J18 on the concerto board. And I'll use this micro USB cable to connect the concerto board to the PC. Oh, and I'm connecting on CN1. Now we can jump to the software guide. To display an image on the EPD through the USB interface, you can run our Windows application, which is the ITE TCON demo app executable. Here I'm running version 2.6. So we click on that to open it up. Then we need to click connect to make sure that the software is linked to the physical drive. Now we can try to load images to the EPD. And to do that, we'll first need to make sure that our start mode and our end mode are two. By default, this came up with two already, so I don't need to change that. Then we'll need to click on set fold panel, which sets the resolution of the display. Then we click on open file, which takes us to a browser where we can pick our image. I'll pick that one. It loaded, so now, now that it's loaded, what I need to do is click on display, and the display should update. There we go. Now, if we want to leave our display in the white state, we can easily do that by clicking on this end clear white item. Then we should make sure that our start and end mode are now zero and we don't need to load an image here, we can just go ahead and click display and that should cause our EPD to update to the white state. There you go. And that's it. As you can see, the plug and play aspect of the e-paper kits make them a great demo unit to experiment with different use cases and images before scaling a project. You can find more information in the video description and in the e-ink kit shop. Thanks for watching.